Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so today's demo is another really cool bath treat from Sweet Shop of Horrors. And this bath bomb is called Hello Me Time. And this one is scented in lavender and eucalyptus, which is absolutely perfect because I don't know if you can tell by my lighting and my shade being pulled down that this is a nighttime bath for me and I did save this one for this time of day or night because this is just a perfect nighttime scent. So um, this is so cool. I don't know if you can see but I think that this is Epsom salt on the top and dry lavender. So I just I think that is so so neat that um, it's got that embellishment on top. And this little guy, this little skeleton, he's just plastic and he's just an embellishment. So. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead, if I don't drop it, and put him in and see what he's going to do for us. Wow, those are cool colors. Oh, this smells so nice. It is really, really late. <laughs> so, this is going to be really nice just to get in here and relax and then just hop in bed and get a really good night's sleep. I can't quite tell what color this looks like on my camera, but it is, it's almost, it's black. It's almost black. And of course it's purple pushing out toward the sides, but let's go down a little bit and check out what's going on down here. Now she sold out of these on her site right now. She actually sold out of the the Feed Me Seymours from the Little Shop of Horrors inspired one. She sold out the day that I um, and posted her demo, so I thought that was pretty cool. And these aren't up right now, but actually by the time this demo is posted, she may have some more up there. Let's take a look at the water over here. Look at that bath art, it's so cool. get a lot of marbled foam usually built up in my tub so I really appreciate that. Well, I think he might be done. And I don't expect anything really to pop up out of this. Okay, so let's just check out, be pretty, check out what it looks like, and then we'll just get to the bubbles. Okay, y'all always know that I forget to show you the watercolor before I turn on the bubbles, but I just noticed this. I didn't notice this a second ago. Look at all the little lavender on top that has settled. Right on top. That's so pretty. I just, I didn't notice that. The little buds. Okay, so let's take a close look at this. Pretty cool. That is definitely, I think, the blackest water I've had. I had one that was about like this, but I think that this might be a little more, um, a little more opaque, I would say. Not maybe darker, but yeah, just a little more opaque. And I think that you're getting a glare that I don't have, so. 
you might not can tell, but it's really cool looking. That's more what I see. done with my hello me time tonight unfortunately but this is what is left in my tub which is really really nothing at all now having said that as far as the water being as dark as it was that's awesome but um, as far as the little lavender buds I can't speak to what they would have been like had I not fished them out before I drained the tub. And I did that because I wanted to make sure and flush out my jets. Um, so I, I like fished them out. I actually have a little goldfish net that I use for um, just anything that might be floating around the tub. And I do that actually a lot when I just, I kind of clean them out and run them when I'm not actually even taking a bath and cleaning my tub. So um, I did that. I fished those out and I ran them and I fished them out and I ran them a couple of times before I drained the tub. And that was just for just making sure that they were going to be nice and fleshed out. So that's why I probably don't have any lavender buds in the bottom of my tub at all. Um, so I can't speak to what that would have looked like just draining the tub. And also, here's the little jack-o'-lantern skeleton man, obviously, that you saw earlier that I fished out. Of the bottom of the tub while I was taking my bath and I think he's really cute so anyway I love the scent of this bath bomb and I had a really nice relaxing bath it was nice and moisturizing I thought the color of the water was really cool so I just really enjoyed this bath and I'm still just really really liking everything I have gotten so far from this company so I will have all the links listed down below and I thank you guys for watching as always and I'll see you back here next time see you later thanks bye bye